Alright, what is going on guys? Today we are watching Spice and Wolf episode 3. Uh, in the last episode, uh, Hollow and Craft were well on their way. And they've stopped at a um, church, I believe. Kind of a large churchy kind of place. Again, I forgot what the name was. Um, yeah, they've kind of stopped here for the night or for a couple days. Um, they were speaking to a man who said that he, was a, he has a money-making opportunity for them. And basically has kind of a new currency that's coming in soon. And so he wants to buy up a lot of a certain, or like the current currency. And then they want to trade it for the new one or vice versa when it comes in. I don't know. Uh, obviously, it was it seemed a little fishy at the time. Uh, Hollow was well aware of that and was kind of explaining to Kraft. Um, hey, I, need, I, I know I need to pay my way in this world when it comes to like food and accommodation and stuff. So here's how I'm going to do it. Um, by like explaining to you like oh this person might actually be scamming you or blah 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 but yeah seemed like a very little interesting episode and uh, very much looking forward to this one so as always guys if you're new to the channel please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well and let's go into this episode right now but who runs this town we have like a council or something or in the form of a beautiful girl, yeah. So they, they pretty much got you dead to rights then. Yeah. Did they throw in the red eyes at all? Oh, okay. That's what she thinks. Or maybe that is true. I don't know. Oh, she's sad. Damn, this place is bustling. This is a rich city. Is he saying he should have invested in Apple? That's funny. She's not listening. She is hungry as hell. Is she even on the cart still? Oh. Get this girl some apples. Buy as many as you like? How many? Alright. That's how many that gets you. Yeah? <laughs> Uh, go on then. You can't have one apple. The devil's fruit. <laughs> Devil fruit. Lol. She's funny. Ah, she's paying attention. Grand expeditions to the north. That's where we want to go. Damn, they must be good at their job. Shrini Silver. Okay. Oh, time to buy. Oh, she's trying to read the room. Oh, you said 140 silver coins now. Oh, let me earn you some more money. Okay, yeah. I was, I was going to say, I, 140. Because they were, he said 140 trenny silver and then 140 silver. I was wondering if they were different. Oh, she's really trying to upsell here. That's funny. Oh, so they're good quality. <laughs> she, right, is, is this because of all the apples that she bought? And covered them? Oh, she's really good at selling. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> give me give me 200. Oh, what a guess. 
So wait, that was... 210, okay. She is making him money. Wow. <laughs> He's begging to buy the pelt at that price. That was fucking dope. Good shit, Hollow. Well, she has definitely earned her keep. Are they got peas as a snack in a bar? Interesting choice. Yeah, <laughs> I was kind of, she was kind of scamming. Damn, that's crazy. What if he figures out and then in the future they try to trade with this guy again, huh? Oh, so he asked about the currency as well. So where is he putting his money? Is it into someone's safe? Pretty dependable? Hmm. Sounds fishy, bro. That's true. And 10% of your profits? Wow. It all sounds quite convincing at the moment. I wonder if this is actually going to go through. After you've after you served up, that's cute. So many silver coins. Oh, she's tired. <laughs> yeah. Jeez. <laughs> I hope you stay beautiful. Oh, so the one we've been talking about. Several hundred? Wow. Yeah, that's all. Basically, our currency works. What is it, bread? Cheesy bread? What is this? Ah, that makes sense. Okay. Rara's connections. Very helpful. I like how she's learning a lot here, and she obviously pays attention as well. Yeah. <laughs> Becoming my wife. That's so funny. <laughs> Stop flirting with my girl. Hmm, are you sure? <laughs> Getting his touches in, this guy. Even he could tell something right there. She definitely knows something, but she's making it seem like there's nothing to this guy. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, she's happy about that. That's cute. Sound duller. Okay. Why is this guy's angle? Only 10 silver? Okay, yeah. Makes sense. It's a safe way to make money. Wait, what is... What is happening right now? Okay, I'm invested. What the hell is happening right now? 
Oh, what? Ah, oh, didn't realize it was the end of the episode. That went so quick. Right, so that was Spice and Wolf episode three. Um, another very good episode there. It's really interesting how this is kind of unfolding. Um, how Hollow is using her wit to kind of, one, make this guy more money, but also understand like people's lies and people's angles and what really the kind of the bigger picture is. I haven't figured it out yet. Obviously, I don't think we're supposed to have figured what out what is happening and what, what this guy's angle is. Um, obviously, Kraft has figured it out here, so we'll find out in the next episode. But uh, yeah, it's... I won't say it's complex, like the the story at the start, but it's very, it's very much an angle I wasn't expecting going into this story. I don't know what I was expecting from kind of how the story was going to play out, but yeah, um, Hollow is a smart girl. Uh, obviously, she's been alive for a very long time, so I assume she's very wise. Um, yeah, this duo is very interesting. Uh, I'm looking forward to seeing uh, if they can make a hell of money in the future as well, and uh, obviously their travels too because they're very they're very cute and they're very funny together as well. But yeah, overall, very good episode. I'm definitely looking forward to the next. Anyway, guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching my reaction. Have a nice rest of your day, and peace out.